This video will provide you with a general understanding of how to perform property searches in Development Eye and return results. On the home page, you are presented with three different search functions location, application, or map search. For this example, we will perform a location search. The search panel below the location search button is where you will need to enter the address of the property that you are wanting to search for. As an example, start typing 10. You will notice as you begin to type the address, it will automatically predict options including addresses, lot and plans, and lot street, which is particularly useful if you do not have the full address details for a property. Once you see the address you are after in the drop down list, select the property and it will automatically open the property details screen. On this screen, you can see that the property is highlighted and a green pin appears. The property details also appear on the left hand side of the screen in the list view. The list view allows you to zoom directly to the property, look at specific details of the property, or dive deeper and generate a development eye site report for the property, which will open in a new tab and provide you with access to planning scheme zoning and overlay information, interactive mapping links, applications and approval information relating to the site, and other general development information such as water and sewer infrastructure and flooding overlays. Going back to Development Eye, if we click on the Details button, the Property Details page will appear. On this page, you will see specific property information, such as the lot and plan, property number and land area details, any applications associated with the property, including current and decided or past applications, any town planning notations relevant for the property, and a zoomed in location map or aerial map of the property. The Property Details page also provides you with links in the top right corner to the Development Eye site report for the property and a link to My Maps, Council's public mapping system providing access to a variety of other information. Clicking on either of these links will open a new tab in your web browser. Like the location search before, you can run a basic search by local government division or by suburb. In the search panel, select Location Search and then enter the division that you are interested in searching for. As an example, let's type in Division 1. As mentioned earlier, you will notice as you begin to type the division, it will automatically populate and predict the word based on what you have typed already. Follow the same steps to run a suburb search, however, rather than entering a division, Enter a suburb that you are interested in searching for. Enter Malulaba. This map shows you all current development activity within this division or suburb by way of dots and through the application results list view on the left hand side. The default setting is to sort submitted applications newest to oldest. However, you can change this view to sort by decided applications as opposed to submitted applications by selecting the drop down arrow next to sort by in the application results list view. The same as when performing any search, you can zoom in and out of areas as you wish with the capability to drop a pin on a property. To do this, click on the small green pin symbol on the right hand side of your screen. Once you have clicked this, you will see the pin has dropped to a property that is central to the map view. Over in the property details panel, you are able to press the zoom button and it will zoom directly to the property. From here, you have the ability to move this dropped pin to a different property that you may be interested in knowing information about, such as the property next door, across the road or up the street as an example. Simply just click on the dropped pin and drag it to the property next door. You might want to save this property for future reference and receive an email alert if a new application is lodged on or nearby the property. You can do this by simply clicking on the save button or alternatively the star symbol. For more information on setting up and receiving email alerts, 
please see the video on how to log in and use safe searches and alerts in Development Eye. This video provides you with a good overview of how to search for a property in Development Eye. Further how-to videos and additional supporting material is available on the Development Eye webpage on Council's website.